Let's see if I can remember how I made this mesh effect in Illustrator. All right, let's select the circle, press and hold shift plus alt, scale it up. I'm gonna swap it and click on the stroke, click on the none and click on the fill again so it's gonna be on the top. And I'm gonna go to the gradient and I'm gonna select the mesh tool or you can press the letter U and I'm gonna click here and on the right, I'm gonna create a square actually, something like this. And I'm gonna start recoloring it. From here, all I need to do is select the direct selection tool and select an anchor point. So I'm gonna go, for example, with this, I'm gonna click on this anchor point and you can go to the fill and change up the color. And I'm gonna go with a blue, this one is gonna be be white and the other one is gonna be orange and this one is gonna be pink I am also going to click on these external points here press and hold shift and I'm gonna select multiple anchor points and I'm gonna recolor them let's see what happens there you go And now after you recolor, all we need to do is just click on the internal anchor points and I'm gonna drag this here. And look at that. It's gonna create this really cool special effect and I'm gonna pull this down. And then I got the orange. I'm gonna pull this on the left. Make sure to not stress it too much because it's gonna create these weird errors. I'm gonna go somewhere here and I'm gonna pull the purple upwards. Of course, now it's gonna look really bad, but we can correct this. So I'm gonna click, for example, on this anchor point and we got some handles going on. And what we can do is pull the handles upwards and rearrange it and we can make more space for the purple. It's really cool. I gotta do the same thing with these, with the purple ones. So we can twist it even more, a little bit. And you also can twist the purple by these angles. Oh, there you go. So I'm gonna curve every one of each like that so we can create the spinning effect. The yellow can go quite a bit out. So I'm gonna go down with the orange like this. I did stylize it a little bit differently, but I think this looks even better. So it's somehow this is the flow of the smash effect. And yeah, 